Hello, Lion King fans. Killcal 178 here, and welcome back for another Shenzi, Bonsai, and Ed video. <laughs> for today's video we are going to be discussing all right you know what i never done a problem video like this so let's just begin all right so we're going to be talking about disney's hyena problem yes disney's hyena problem and the more that i think about shinzi and bonsai and ed the more that i think about the flaws that line guard has the more that I think about having Shinzi and Banzai Ned back, the more that I think that I do not want to make Shinzi videos anymore. I'm sorry, guys. There are so many problems that I really have to say to you guys and that I just found out. And now that I look back into all my Lion King videos, let's, pull, let's put it all together. <laughs> doesn't care about Shenzi and Banzai Ned. Yes, that is no surprising that they don't care about Whoopi Goldberg's character and, and, and Banzai and Ed. They don't care about them anymore. I'm sorry, but they just do not care about them anymore. The more that we that we want Shenzi and Banzai Ned back, the more Disney doesn't want them to bring them back. Lion King 2019, right? I thought that we would like, it would be more better, but, you know what, looking back at Lion King 2019, I really hate it more, I am sorry, but it's just awful, Lion King 2019, the reboot is just awful, and I really hate that Shenzi from Lion King 2019, I really don't like the tone of that Shenzi, yes, as you guys know, I really hate 2019 Shenzi, I really despise that Shenzi, I hate her, I really do not like that Shenzi from 2019, I just wish that Shenzi never existed. I'd ra rather stick with Whoopi Goldberg's um, Shenzi. But you know what? With, with every single reboot that Disney is doing, the more that it's causing them to just like uh, go downhill. And it's not just that. It's more than that how Disney is just putting like like their characters to use and um, like in remakes and just live action stuff. Like get rid of that Disney. Like, when is this going to end? Here's the thing. Here's my question. When is this going to be over with? When is Disney ever going to stop doing live action movies? When? When are we going to get to the animation? And when are we going to get it now? When are we going to see a Shenzi and Banzai Nen? And it turns out, we're never going to get that. We're never going to get that. But that will be another um, topic that we will discuss later on. Um, but the next topic that I'll also say, uh, it'll be more than interesting. And it's going to be about the hyenas. So, looking back at Lion Guard, guys, um, as you know about the, the hyena genre, yes, he is the son of Shinzi and Banzai Ned. We still don't know much about it. But, you know what? Looking back at Lion Guard, there's something definitely wrong with the show. And I mean, um, it's going to be about the episodes, right? Now, you know the hyena Jaziri? Well, she didn't get that much episodes um, in the Lion Guard uh, series. Now, let me just tell you guys this. She gets um, two episodes in season one, two episodes in season two, and three episodes in season three. Now, let's go ahead and uh, do like a balance board right here. So, um, season one, there's 28 episodes, and Jaziri has two episodes. Season 2, there's a total 30 episodes, and Jaziri gets 2. And Season 3, there's 20 episodes, and Jaziri gets 3. 
at the surface. Now, do you see the problem right here? Are these balanced? No, they're definitely not. They're definitely not balanced at all. Jaziri did not get that much episodes in the Lion Guard. And like, how? Why didn't she get that much um, episodes in the Lion Guard? Why didn't she didn't get that much episodes in the Lion Guard, Disney? Ask me that. Why didn't she get that much episodes in the Lion Guard? How many episodes have you even gave Janja? How many episodes did Janja got? Like, 10 or like that much episodes? Like, Jaziri didn't get that much episodes or screen time in the Lion Guard. Not that much. She didn't even get that much episodes in the Lion Guard. Because that goes to show you that Disney does not care about their own characters at all. And that's the same thing with the Hyena Cubs, Wima and Tumi. Um, they didn't grow up in the Lion Guard in, um, um, in the Battle for the Pride Lands episode. They didn't grow up when Kion and the rest of them did. That goes to show you that they don't care about their own characters and just write them off like they're just there or something and just like make it feel like a like a plot hole or something. But anyways, here's the next topic. Um, it's the problem about the line guard. Now let me just say guys, um, this topic that we're going to discuss is the Rise of Scar episode. And boy, boy, oh boy, oh boy, where do I even start with the Rise of Scar? You know what, guys? The way that I that I look back at the Rise of Scar episode, I have a. Let me just be honest, guys. I never thought that I disliked the Lion Guard episode like this. Like, yes, you brought back Scar from Lion King One, but let me just be honest. The Rise of Scar episodes were just disappointing to me. I'm sorry, but they are disappointing. I am. I'm sorry. They're just. There's just nothing that's just special to me about the Rise of Scar when I look back at it. Like, Ushari told Janja that he knows a, that a lion that talks to hyenas, and he's talking about Scar talking to Shenzi and Banzai Ned. He probably knows something about Shenzi and Banzai Ned. Like, wouldn't it be surprising if Ushari would have, like, told Janja about his parents? Like, how do you think Janja would have felt? Um, he would have memories about his parents. Like, Janja is really unaware about the paintings of, like, his family from the first movie. And it's them, Shenzi and Banzai Ned. He has to know something. Janja really has to know something because he has to be aware about the paintings of his family. And why didn't Disney do that? Why didn't they mention Shenzi and Banzai Ned in The Lion Guard? That's the big problem right here. That's the main problem th about the show. That is the biggest problem about the Lion Guard. The biggest problem is about Shenzi and Banzai Ned not appearing in the show. They didn't get reference, no mentions, no nothing about them. Like, yes, we did get references, like, of the scenes of them, like, Janja doing the birdie boiler of, from Zazu. Um, uh, Janja, she's in Jungle chasing down the herd. That's the same thing Shenzi and Banzai Ned did. But no mention or reference of the names of Shenzi and Banzai Ned. Why is that? Because Disney doesn't care about their own characters. That's the main thing right there. Disney doesn't care about Shenzi and Banzai Ned. Why? Because I care. I care, do I? Do you guys care? Yes, you do. I care about Shinzi and Banzai Ned being in the show. I care about Shinzi and Banzai Ned in my heart. I care for them and I always have love for Shinzi and Banzai Ned. I'll always love Shinzi no matter what. No matter what. I'll always love Shinzi because she's the voice of Whoopi Goldberg. Whoopi Goldberg's my favorite actress. Um, and that's just, that's the problem. Shinzi and Banzai Ned are not in the show and I need to know that the theories are true and I see it. I'm trying to show the truth to you guys and Disney won't show it. Now, here's the last topic that I would want to say about the problem about the hyenas. Now, here's the thing. Disney, you need to do better next time with your characters. Now, here's the thing. You need to give Shenzi and Banzai Ned a movie. Because at the end of the day, if you go downhill, then something's gonna go bad. No, Mufasa the Lion King is not an excuse. Don't bring up Mufasa the Lion King. I don't want that movie to happen. Seriously, guys, I do not want that live action sequel to happen. I do not want Mufasa the live action Lion King movie to happen at all. Like, I don't want this to happen. 
like, like, here's the thing. The main problem that I show you guys is Jaziri not getting enough episodes and the mentions of Shenzi and Banzai Net. Now, no, the live action remakes are not an excuse for that. No, don't just like remake and, and restart the whole story. You gotta continue to the story and just fix something that, uh, the mistake you made. Now, if you would have done a fourth season of Lion Guard, you have to give the hyenas the respect that they deserve. Yes, I'll always need to have the, the hyenas get the respect that they deserve. They deserve better in the Lion King franchise. They deserve better. Not the Lion characters. Lamb. Now listen, I want a season that's just focused on the hyenas Disney. Not with the Lion characters. Now listen, I love the Lion characters. Yes, like, I like Simba, I like Nala, but I don't want Disney to just focus on them anymore. I want them to just move on from Simba and Nala and the rest of them. I want them to just move on from the Lion Guard characters. I want them to just move on. We we need to focus on the hyenas. We need to focus on Shenzi. We need to focus on Banzai and Ed. We need to learn the backstory of them first. I need a movie about Shenzi and Banzai and Ed to learn the backstory of how they became the trio that we all know and love. If we have a movie of them first, then I want a season four of Lion Guard. And then after that season, that would be the end of the franchise, right? Yes, that would be. Because it turns out, when are we going to have that? We're never going to have that. Because it's Disney. It's Disney. Disney just thinks that it's okay to just forget about these hyena characters. And are they just forgotten in the franchise? No. They're not forgotten without me. And with the videos that I'm making about them. Was at the end of the day, we need Shenzi and Banzai Ned back. No, I am never going to stop talking about Shenzi and Banzai Ned. Now, don't excuse Mufasa the Lion King. No, I don't want this movie to happen at all. No, Mufasa the Lion King won't do justice for me. It would never, ever do justice. Because when that movie comes out, it's going to flop. So, put your bets up right now because I bet you that movie is really going to flop. And the headcanons about the Lion King franchise are going to get worse. And it will get worse within time. And if Disney doesn't listen to us, even listen to me. Take it from me, guys. Because I have theories about Shinzi and Banzai Net about at the end of the day. And Disney, for the last time, bring back Shinzi and Banzai Net. Well, yes, everyone, that's going to be it for today's video. If you guys liked it, make sure you like comment and also if you're new to my channel hi i'm kill kill once and mate i talk about lion king and the hyenas um and if you're new to my channel um make sure you click that subscribe button and click those post notifications just to make sure you don't miss out on any more videos to come because i make good content for you guys i really make good content for you guys um and if you're and if you're not new to my channel hi welcome back but yeah guys thanks for watching and i and i'll see y'all next time have an amazing day, everyone.